Hi guys, how are you? Um, I'm at a. Um, you can see Casey, she's inside. <laughs> how are you doing? So, how'd you like my uh, mustache? Pretty good? <laughs> uh, between 0 to 10, what would you think? 0 to 10. <laughs> uh, 0 as in take it away, 10 as in not too bad. Keep it there, keep it there. Alright. Apologize for the sound. I'm at the corner of this very nice uh, cafe called City Gun. If you're ever in Penang, come over here. Really good, really good coffee. And um, so today I want to talk about mindsets. Exactly what the topic is today. So the thing is, do you have a growth mindset or a fixed mindset? Okay. So I guess. You know, it's hard to say if it's good or bad, if it's fixed is good or growth is bad, but I think typically people may say that having a fixed mindset is probably a bit more limiting, okay? Hi Monica, how are you? <laughs> and hi Wendy. So, uh, so what's a growth and a fixed mindset? Um, so, I, I think... Um, I think growth sounds better, doesn't it? It's like, okay, I have a growth mindset. But sometimes we all have a little bit of a fixed mindset. So a fixed mindset, just like the word says fixed, means that we're pretty much fixed. Uh, we're kind of like, you know, it's a bit more limiting. That means that um, uh, this is who I am, I'm like that, I'm like that one, or you know, I, I can't change, I'm like that, I'm fixed. Um, and of course, if you kind of are a bit fixed, it's a bit limiting, again, that means that, um, you know, probably hard to learn new things, or in other words, can be a little bit stubborn, you know, hey? Um, so, in terms of growth, in terms of um, learning new stuff, a bit limited, okay? Um, I don't want to say that's good or bad, but I think that we can make our own judgments as to being fixed or growth, which, I, which one is better. <laughs> Hi, James. Um, so, growth, what is growth? Growth, of course, sounds a bit more um, free, freedom, you know, growth, that means you're growing. So you believe in progress, you believe in improvement, you believe in perseverance, you believe in, you know, there's always something to learn, isn't it? So, um, uh, I know it's a bit like trivial as in, you know, do you have a fixed or growth mindset? Maybe in certain situations we're probably more fixed, in certain situations we feel like we should be more growth mindset. I always kind of think about my son, uh, oh, my kids, especially when I talk about mindsets, because Sometimes my kid, or let's say Jay Hans, he likes to learn new things, so I give him a, a new puzzle to, to figure out. And, you know, um, and, and, and when he can't figure it out, he'll say, oh, I cannot, I cannot one, I cannot, you know. So he, he at first, he, he probably has a fixed mindset saying, I can't, I cannot do it. But then I'm very careful as to how to have him uh, accept a growth mindset to say that, well, yeah, you can, but you can learn, right? I mean, remember remember the Rubik's Cube? You didn't know how to do it, but then later you can, right? You know, the algorithm. So I have to remind him that there's such a thing called, you know, not, not that he needs to understand growth mindset or fixed mindset, that he can learn something. So I think that's important. And... Um, um, or else if I don't correct that, then he'll always be in the mindset of, um, I cannot, you know, I'm not the type, or, you know, and, you know, so sometimes if we don't kind of be aware about these mindsets, these two, when we grow older, we start to accept certain limitations as the truth then. Um, uh, I can't, I cannot, I, I don't know how, I'll never learn. And we start to label ourselves and categorize ourselves in such a way we limit ourselves. So we, we instead of growing, we limit ourselves and we go the other way, right? So a fixed mindset probably is uh, less conducive to growth and, um, and it, it's kind of like putting ourselves in a corner that we won't be able to uh, grow or improve. So having a growth mindset is probably the best thing to do. A growth mindset, again, is more about, yeah, I can learn, I can improve, um, uh, I will persevere, uh, I can get better, I can learn new things. Um, so definitely there is more growth and more improvement and more progress and definitely more hopeful if you have a growth mindset, okay? So, um, 
So you know, I think it's pretty pretty trivial. You know, if you you know, do you have a growth or, or, or a fixed mindset? But I think it's good to be aware. It's good to know the difference. So that in any situation, we're we'll asking ourselves, you know, hey, am I am, am I limiting myself to learn new things? So for example, when I first participated in new skin business, um, although I didn't understand, didn't like it, didn't want to do anything about it, I realized that I was in a fixed mindset, right? Because I knew engineering, I knew program management, I knew I was an employee, but could I do something different? And once I started to complain and criticize and, you know, you know was doubtful, I started to find myself being in a fixed mindset that, no, I cannot, I'm not the type, um, uh, you know, I, I don't like this, I don't like this, so I became very fixed mindset. Um, it took me a while as I understood the industry and I understood the purpose of the industry did I realize, well, if I don't know, I should find out. If I want to learn, I should go and learn. I may not be good, but I can get better. I may fail, but I can persevere and I can uh, eventually succeed. So, at first, me, I was fixed in this industry, I didn't believe it, not me, I cannot, never, never, never. As I understood it, as I started to accept the facts and the information, I realized, hmm, if I want that kind of lifestyle, then yes, I, I should have a growth mindset to learn, to persevere, to improve, and to look at progress. And I think the growth mindset helped me ultimately, right, to allow me to have a different lifestyle, allow me to have different choices in my life. So, um, which one is good or bad? Well, hey, you know, sometimes fixed mindsets helps us, um, but I think in terms of progress and improvement and changing the things that we want, growth mindset pretty much is uh, the way to go. <laughs> so anyway, I hope that kind of makes sense, uh, having fixed and growth mindset. Um, so whenever you are labeling or limiting yourself, fixed mindset, Whenever you believe in progress, perseverance, and improvement, then that's growth mindset. So catch your kids having it, you know, kind of correct them when they have fixed and growth mindset so that they switch over the growth mindset and look at the long distance, long term opportunities uh, rather than short term gain. All right, so I hope that helps. Uh, if you tag anyone that uh, you find this helpful, um, do like, um, do comment. And yeah, follow if you like to know more and uh, listen to more uh, of my sharings. And I hope my sharings help, uh, you know, give some insight into our everyday lives. All right. So anyway, um, I guess I'll, who's it? Hi, Cicely. Hi, Rafe Arfan. And hi, Alice. Hi, He Che. How are you? <laughs> hi, Oliver. Okay. So. How do you like my uh, my mustache? Looks good. Does it does it suit me? If it does, I'm gonna figure out how to grow this. I can never grow a mustache, but it looks good, doesn't it? <laughs> all right. Have a good one. I'll see you guys in a few days. All right. Take care now. Bye bye.